Sports Report. Welcome back to Citrus TV News. I'm Connor Federico. It's no secret to Orange fans that Syracuse men's basketball is only a couple wins away from the Final Four. This year's Syracuse squad has extremely exceeded expectations. SU and Loyola Chicago are both 11 seeds, the two highest seeded teams remaining in the tournament. And now for updates from Omaha, let's bring in Citrus TV reporter Christian de Guzman. Christian, Syracuse was literally the last team selected for the tournament a couple weeks ago. How in the world did the Orange end up in the Sweet 16? Connor, I really can't tell you the answer to that question because no one really knows. But the closest thing I can give you is defense. Syracuse has dominated on the defensive side of the ball. The 2-3 zone shut down three prolific offenses in TCU, Arizona State, and also now Michigan State. One of the biggest upsets, if it wasn't for UMBC and Loyola Chicago, probably one of the biggest upsets in the tournament. But this is a Syracuse team that is enjoying Omaha right now. Being in a Sweet 16, great matchup against Duke, a team that they faced earlier this season. But what's really motivating voting uh, Syracuse players such as O'Shea Brissett and Frank Howard to win in Omaha is the promise of what happens next week in San Antonio should the Orange pull out two wins here. Yeah, you know, Frank Frank talks about the Final Four experience and, you know, guys who have been on the team uh, for that Final Four experience. You know, she says it's nothing like it. So, uh, you know, they, they, they encourage us, you know, to play hard because we want to make it that far, uh, you know, and then, you know, potentially go into the uh, championship game, you know, because that's something that no one here has you know, experienced except for the coaches. But, uh, you know, we just, we just want to keep playing every game, game by game. But we also know, you know, the bigger goal is to make it, you know, to the next game. Well, it's going to be tough for Syracuse to make it into San Antonio for the Final Four. But Frank Howard said, got to take it one game at a time because if you look too far ahead, that's where the losses will come in this tournament. Reporting live from CenturyLink Center in Omaha, Nebraska, Christian Guzman, Citrus TV News.